Hey guys, SF here and Okta Soji is back for 6 hours and I'll be using it with the farmable party and my farmable homing party so Fisron, uh, Yoshinobu and Inari uh, why Inari is there is because of the blast my friend's gonna be a teeny so 3 homing monsters and a blast monster let's do this I am very very scared <laughs> that I might not beat this but uh, why I brought why I made a homing party is because mobs are really annoying in this in this dungeon a lot of them shoot damage walls and it's easy it's more reliable damage because for farmables actually right? for for farmables because there are a lot of minions and lots of gravity barriers around those minions so it's more reliable But yeah, my only no gravity barrier monsters are Farmable, are Slowing, and Momotaro, and that's not the best choices for this dungeon. The bad part is really hard to stall. First battle done, second battle. There he is. Good. I was lucky you didn't get the heart. Okay, minions are finally gone. What the hell did he hit there? Okay, that was awkward. Almost dead. And there he goes. Everything stalled up. And his boss, 22 turns with speed clear and 3 bars. Starting off with Viseron.
three walls. Really? No! How the hell did that happen? It is a second state card. Oh my god, thank you. Nice, and that should be some overkill there as well. Let's see how much it depletes off. Not that much. I missed everything. Join the party. You know, they got one part. Part two, that's fine. Okay. Those hitboxes, though. So far, so good. Last bar. Uh, not speed clear, but that's fine. This run. Let's do it. Not that much damage. What the hell? Okay, sure. Just strike shot. Halfway there. Oh yeah, four walls. I didn't notice that because I didn't care because this round is involved. Damage wall monster. That's not scary at all. And it wasn't. I don't want to get more in there. Ooh, that's gotta hurt a bit. Gonna use Meteor. Hopefully I can hit him. Okay, got one shot off. And he is stunned. Time for... Teeny to grab the heart. I'm gonna bounce off the wall just in case. I might hit that drone. Man, it didn't do anything. Party on Ulta. I completely missed everybody. Oof. XP 
explosion. There's a heart. Visceron is up next. He's not attacking next turn, but better be a little safe. Get away, grab hearts. Survive! Whew! Whew. Uh, who's next? He's up next, so he can grab the heart when needed. Whew. 89 health. But homing party beats Oaksta. That amount of HP left. Doesn't get more close than this, and I got two drops. I don't need him though. I already ascended, I already ascended and then evolved him. But Oaks the Soji. Uh, I go with the evolve form because of his Mech Slayer L. Some people might go for it for the. Uh, let's see mine. That's the evolve form. Uh, Mech Slayer L. Uh, it's the same thing as Visceron, where you bash the first enemy and then the guy gets knocked up. X Laser L. Yeah. I go for the I go for the evolve version, but the the other version, the ascended version, some people go for that because of the extra ability of no damage wall and the homing. But I like this one better because Maxler L can be very useful in uh, mine machines later in the future when there are mine machines, there are robots, and there are part there are. Uh, what you call it? Bouncing lasers. Those guys are also machines or mechs, I think. But yeah, that's it. Okta Soji with farmables. Uh, farmable monsters. So Visron, Yoshinobu, Inari. Hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.